this is being a tourist in my own city. Let's go. Holy. Anybody that lives in Edmonton with a loud muffler, holy. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. We are tourists in Edmonton, Alberta. What's your thoughts on Edmonton, my love? It's nice, right? It's hot. It's hot today. This is actually my first time ever going to White Ave. So, it's going to be an adventure with the family. We are on a road called White Ave. And it's filled. Filled with a lot of... Um, homegrown small businesses which I really love and it's actually my first not really my first time because every time I do come down here it's uh it's drinking like back in the day like this was like the party house like in the back of the days where I was yeah. mama was hungry for something new what do you what are you feeling I don't know because <laughs> you know it kind of feels like Vancouver right yeah like the Vancouver market you know it's just walking down you know it's beautiful, right? It's nice. It's nice. It's like these little shops are very like cute and fun. Look at this, look at this bubble. It looks like the artwork down in uh, Edmonton somewhere. All right, big shout out to all the influence of Edmonton here. You guys hype this place up because it doesn't look like there's a lot of selection that you guys placed out, or maybe just today is where you did, I don't know. Uh, they don't have a big selection, but when you put it all together, it looks like there's a lot of selection in the box, right? But where they kind of laid it out, it does not look like they have a lot, but like, they do have a lot, okay? I see quality-wise, multi doors. My first time I tried multi doors, it's super popular. Oh, wow. Huh? That's actually really good. It's a chewy, it tastes like a donut, but it's very chewy, like a mochi, but it's deep fried. It's good. Oh. It's very windy, but to be honest, that's not my problem, I'm very inside. Here, mochi, matcha. Hey, first time I ever tried it, it's very good. Oh, my. Very, very good. Okay. I'm a very big fan of this now. First time I ever tried the Mochi Donut. Wow. You guys never had it before? That's a, a very good texture style donut. This is the texture I think my wife will really, really like. Because when it comes down to donuts like this, I think my wife likes it too close. I don't think my wife will like this as much because it's kind of stale, but it's still very good. Wow. Mochi donut definitely is my what can I say? My, my favorite is ice cream now. Ice cream. Donut now. Croissant with cream. Custard cream and strawberry. I think my wife will love this. Yeah. We see in the YouTube <laughs> yeah, yeah. every day. Yeah, we watch a lot of uh, ASMR Korean uh, bakery, and every time we see this, it's like, wow, man, we gotta try it today. But here, yeah, bite on this. I sneak this you, right? I missed you in the beginning because you guys had a small selection of never. But let me say this, that small selection has been cut. You're gonna love this one. Really good, eh? Baby Dragon, you want some? 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 First time here. Eight? Uh, eight. Eight. Yeah, eight's a good number. Yeah. Look at my boy, look at my boy, look at my boy. Here we go, next to the next location in Edmonton, Alberta. What does Edmonton, Alberta have? What's up, man? What's up, girl? Nice and like beef, uh, white pepper broth. 
but the noodles are really good in Philly. Uh, one little tip that I'm not gonna drop the name of the that place because I don't know the kitchen was open and I've seen everything. Right? I've seen everything. It was kind of it gave me the shivers. I just want to say when it comes down to gloves, it's not always clean. So you guys, let's say that part, right? So I'm not gonna drop a location, but here, new location, Chicago style pizza. Even if it's not um, the Chicago style pizza uh, shape, it does have the, the pan frying in the back and it's cut. It's cut like you could just eat it. Guys, buy a nice, go crack this guy. Sweet pop it. Go that fire. Even though it's not the shape of the Chicago South Pizza, the back of this is very good. Very good. It's a small shop. It's a very small shop, but. Mm. Very good for the South Pizza. You know, I kind of forgot how the Chicago South Pizza kind of looked, but this sliced pizza, very good. Here's a very popular, very popular. Oh my lord. Look at this fried chicken. Look how good this looks. I ain't gonna lie. The coleslaw, not really my thing when it comes down to coleslaw, just because I don't know. I kind of like it on the side rather than on the chicken, but from the the looks of it, it's hefty. It's very hefty. Let's try chicken. Oh, that's crunchy. I didn't get any chicken, that was only dope. But got pieces of chicken, but I think the pieces of chicken is the end part of the chicken breast. That's why it's a little dry. Let's try this out. Nice, well rounded, crusted fried chicken. I said that. Yeah, two pommes. Mmm. Definitely very spicy. <laughs> it's a great fried chicken, I say that. It's a great fried chicken, seasoning wise. Mm. Nothing too wild for me to be like, whoa, you know, but it's a good fried chicken. Mm. For me, for preference, I like the coasta on the side rather than the, the, the sandwich, but let's go for the coasta bite. Yeah, which I get it. I still stand but the coasta on the side rather than on the chicken. But good fried chicken sandwich. Mm. If I can compare it to Popeyes, Popeyes still has it, right? Popeyes still has it. 